Hey, what's up, everyone? Hope everyone is well. Today we're gonna make a cool color slide transition thingy in Adobe After Effects and Adobe Illustrator. And it's not really a tutorial I plan from beginning to end, but I I just want to trigger you guys to have fun in these programs. So um, let's just play around, have some fun, and hopefully some of this will be useful for you. Let's start by going to Adobe Illustrator create a artboard that is 1080p so that's 9020 by 1080 pixels uh, or whatever size you're gonna use for your After Effects project and first we're gonna create three cool colors so I'm just gonna do this very quick voila that should be fine now we actually have to create another artboard for some copy Um, poo, that's a lot of lorem ipsum. Well, of course, I'm gonna go for a film that scale this up. And let's select a nice font. I'm going for Montserrat. I actually thought it was Monster Rat, but that's of course bullshit. <laughs> okay. Now align this to the center. And I want this to be aligned to the center of my artboard as well. So there we go. And I'm gonna copy this one more time. And we will have to expand the text. There we go. So now we're pretty much finished in Adobe Illustrator. But just copy this color for now. Come on, see. And now we can go to After Effects create a new composition again these settings are fine and start by creating a new solid now paste the color we just copied and now let's go to 20 frames create a new keyframe for the position create another keyframe now go back one keyframe and just um let's see let's add 90 20 so it moves outside of our composition now add a easy ease to it it's still not that smooth so we're gonna add a um, effect from uh sorry an expression from ease and width as you can see it has turned red so now the expression has been added there's the code okay so that looks pretty cool so let's just cut it at four seconds you can do that by hitting shift command D and let's make a marker at two seconds you can do that by hitting shift 8 and now double click and let's type in second solid so that's where our second solid will have to start now copy this solid go to illustrator and copy the color code of the second color hit shift command y there we go all right let's move it Okay, that's fine for now. Copy it again. Copy the third color. Okay. Now copy it one more time. And the final one has to be white. And now we can actually move around with these colors. Just create an order you like. And I think it's nice to actually play around with the different speeds so one goes faster than the other. There we go. And let's just move this white solid all the way to the back. Let's just call this 
solar transitions. Now we have to create a new composition. Let's just call it final and drag in the solid transitions composition. And now head over to Illustrator, copy the expanded type, go back to After Effects, select the solid transitions composition, hit Command V, and now we've created a mask for our type. So let's see what happens. Pretty cool, right? So now we're gonna add the solid transitions one more time. Go to transform and just rotate it 180 degrees. Now it looks like this. You might want to change the opacity to about 85 maybe. Yeah, that looks about right. Maybe we have to add a, another white solid and drag it to the bottom. And what we can do is actually at the end, um, maybe it's cool if we drag the uh, white solid down so you're left with just the uh, film that type. So just pull this down. Again, add a easy ease, select both frames, go to ease and whiz again. Yeah, that's it. And maybe we can just cut this one off. So again, shift, come on, D. And then we will be left with just the type, I guess. Yeah, that's it. So that's pretty much it guys. Now of course you can import this project into Adobe Premiere and use this as a top layer and beneath you can add your own video so everything that's black right now will be replaced by your video and I can imagine that this will be pretty cool for your YouTube intro um, for your trailer whatever just just use it as you like and um, just have fun creating this so that's it for this video hope it helped and I'll see you guys in the next one bye bye